With your artwork selected, you can go to the control panel at the top of the screen and click on Recolor Artwork. We're now presented with a much more compact dialog box. Starting at the top under Colour Library, you can click on there and you can choose to recolor the selected artwork from everything it finds in your swatches panel or you can refine by the colour groups it finds in there. This document has four and if I click on Sunflower, it will apply that theme to my selected artwork. You can go back in there and you can choose different colour groups if you wish to, to apply those and see what they look like. If you don't like what you see, you can now go up to the top left hand side and choose Undo Changes or in fact you can choose Redo Changes as well. And if you wish to reset the artwork, well, we have a reset button to take it back to what it looked like before we enter this dialog box. It's also worth noting that under the drop down menu for color library, you have access to Illustrator's pre installed libraries. So if you wish to see what maybe art history and pop art looks like, then wonder no more. I'll go back up to reset, and we also now have the color theme picker. So if I click on this, you can hover over any imported artwork in your document and with a left click, you can sample the color data and apply that to your artwork. If you sample a theme you like, it will display its prominent colors lower down in the dialog box. Each of these colors has a slice on the left edge. By dragging that slice towards the right hand side, you reduce how much that color is used or conversely drag that slice towards the left hand side to increase the use of that color. You can go down to the brightness slider to increase the brightness by dragging towards the right hand side or you can darken the artwork by dragging to the left. Once you find a colour theme that you like, you can click on the save button down at the bottom. This will allow you to save a theme and add it to your swatches panel. You have two choices. You can choose save just the prominent colours. It won't allow you to give it a name but it will add it down at the bottom in there. If you wish to get all of the colours then you can just go back into the same option and choose save all colours and it will add them in there. One thing to bear in mind is if you do create a theme and you saved it, if you click on reset, it will remove that color theme from your swatches panel. So just watch out for that one. And that folks is the newly updated recolor artwork dialog box in Illustrator 2021. <laughs>